We are kicking it off here at 197 from Campbell. Levi Hopkins, the Alaska native, taking on, like Ryan said earlier, Michael Batista coming up from 184 to kick this duel off. Hopkins is a, is a pretty physical 197. Um, one really cool fun fact about him, you're going to see his brother later today at 184. They actually both grew up in Alaska, both state champs out of Alaska, and they help with a family fishing business that brings up thousands of pounds of fish. That that's where they say all their strength comes from. And here we go, Rhett. Quick hand fighting Hopkins with a nice snap. Collar tie. Not much happening right now as far as, oh, Hopkins goes in for a shot, kind of extended already. Batista does not look like a very small 197. Be no. somebody coming up 184. He looks like he fits into the weight pretty well. Hopkins got to get get out from right underneath him here. He's got to try and he's got to control that elbow. He's going to start working to the left here. It looks like maybe looking for a peek out. Ref goes stalemate. Back to our feet and back to center we go. 0-0 zero, zero after the first 45 seconds. Collar ties going. A little high crotch knee pull action from it's Batista gets it. it up. Hopkins fighting on the edge here. Batista's trying to bring it back in. Batista goes one way, then the other. Traps it. Now he's going to try to lift it up. A little shin wizard action there. Hopkins, Still in here. Hopkins looking comfortable and tough, and we're out. Found solid defense there Act, by Hopkins. An action call by the official on the edge there as well. Batista, instead of a qualifier, and has a win over the brother of Levi Hopkins, Caleb Hopkins, last year, two-time Virginia State champ in high school. And as we've said, he's up from 184 this year. Oh, Hopkins slick in a ankle pick from Hopkins. Ankle pick there. Batista straight to his feet and gets the one. That was a slick ankle pick from Hopkins there. Great job, Batista, though. As soon as he, as soon as he gave up that two, starting to work for that escape, came straight out. Yeah, that was huge for him not, not to give up any riding time, make sure no. he gets that point back, back in on a shot. And both Hopkins, Hopkins brothers are pretty long, lanky guys. You know, they're not short and stocky. Batista is that short, stocky, big legs, powerful guy. That was a powerful Heavy snap, snap from yeah. Hopkins. Now, Hopkins, not only is he an Alaskan state champ, but he also does in the classroom as well, as he was the SOCOM Pinnacle Award winner last year, and that's given to the highest GPA on the championship team. So... Gets it done in the classroom as well. Student athlete first there. Good level change by Batista. Hanging on the head. Hopkins dives Hopkins in on a single. On shot here. Coming up with it. Trapped in between. Brings it up. Can he finish? He's got 15 seconds left in the first period here. He's moving him. He's got to try and bring him back to the center here. Sucks it back and gets the two at the end of the period. Can Batista... It'll be big if Batista can get the escape here. Looks like Hopkins is going to ride him out here. Yeah, three seconds left. That's going to be huge for the ride out. Bringing the score to four to one, entering big the second time period. For Hopkins there. Beautiful high crotch. Switches it to a head inside single. Runs the pipe, gets the two. Hopkins is going to start the second period on bottom here. Campbell University is going to be in the gray singles today. The gray the green anklets, Virginia in the white with the red. Let's go double claw here. Hopkins kind of Hop. going out to a quad pod here. Batista doing a really good job getting that forward pressure going. Now on his toes, driving forward. Hopkins to his feet. And out. In, gets one. 5-1 lead here. Batista goes collar and wrist. Hopkins goes double collar. Both guys want to wrestle in the middle of the mat here. Love to see that.
we have Coach Steve Garland over in the corner, the head coach of University of Virginia. He was a NCAA finalist back in his wrestling career. He also has Jack Mueller for Virginia in the corner with him. NCAA finals a few years ago for University of Virginia. Batista stalking here. In on the shot. Good knee pull single. He's got a leg on the outside, he lifts it up. It. He's got it up. He's been in this position once before earlier in the match and was unable to convert. He's got to bring him back to the middle. Hopkins. He runs the pipe. Runs the pipe here. Hopkins showing some flexibility. Yep. Solid shot defense here by Levi Hopkins. And two for Batista with a little was under 30 seconds left in the second period Great here. train wrestling by Batista. Hopkins Went. to his feet. Looks like he's going to try and return here. He's got to be careful here. He's going to get hit with a stall call as he's extended on the leg. Campbell Corner's already calling for it. There's the and stall. And he does get hit with a stalling. Hang on, let's go. Hopkins looking for a cradle here. He's got it locked. He's got it. Four seconds this left could be in the big second period. The... Can he get the fall here? Oh, man, that was close. A fall there wow. would have been huge for the team score. Wow, that was close. 11 to 3 going into the third period here. A huge. That reversal to the cradle with the back points just blew this match wide open. In the corner for the Campbell Camels. 11 to 3. Is, and we start this third period. Chris Cober. Ride time at 17 seconds for Hopkins. Not going to be a factor yet. A caution on green here. Batista right to that quad pod, up to his Straight feet. to his feet. Fight in hands. Hopkins goes trip, brings him back. Batista straight back up. He has a sense of urgency here. He knows he's got to get back to his feet to get back in this match. Hopkins with a good pressure moving forward. Batista trying to save the major here. A major would be big in a tight duel like this one. Hopkins doing a great job controlling this ankle back here. As riding time starts to click in his favor, 18 seconds now in his favor. Flattens him out here. Batista going to build another base. Hopkins doing a great job controlling these ankles. And if you got a guy that likes to go to that quad pod, that's one of the biggest things you got to do is take that base away. Yeah, both these Hopkins brothers are really good on top, especially with that tra with trapping the leg, uh, collecting ankles. Throwing Campbell a boot Faithful in. Calling for a stall call here. Yep, fans want it bad. And here and it comes. He gets it. And that's the second stall call, so and that's that a point. Should be one point green there. That brings it to 12 3, and as riding time goes over in a minute. So right now we're essentially 13 to 3. Wow, what a period on top so far for Hopkins. Control in this match, putting it away. Right in front of the Campbell corner. They're Chris Kober, assistant coach. Win Mahalik, assistant coach. Hopkins going to right great into his job ear. keeping this one foot in and yep. keeping this clock ticking down and not letting Batista get a fresh start in the middle. And he is dominating this yep. period here. The Campbell crowd is loving it. With five seconds left. Looks like Campbell's going to take this one. And a big win to start out this duel. Very controlling win there. Awesome offense on his feet, but even more impressive on top. Huge shift getting that cradle. And then right out in the third period, forcing the stall calls.